Okay, we're actually um, a bit close to the lathe now and you might be able to see the meter better. So what we'll do... Okay, crank it up and as you can see, straight over six. You might not be able to see so well. Let me just turn it a little. That's showing me around about 650. Yeah. So, um, so my chart says 630, but it's actually rotating at 650. So what we're going to do now is I'm going to change, uh, I'll change to a, where are we, I'll change to an even lower speed, I'll take it right down to 160, and um, in fact it's at 160 RPM, so which means we can use the really, so we can, we'll check all three, um, all three ranges, yeah, um, right, well, we'll take that one off there, okay, so what I've done is I've ramped it up to the top speed, because uh, that was easiest for me to do. Because um, to get it onto the lowest speeds, I've got to change a couple of belts. So I thought I'd do this first. Um, so according to my chart, I should be at 1,600. Okay, which means it's going to be over there. Okay, and we're 1,400, 1,550. So once again, it's slightly off. do as run a nice fast speed we'll try on the 20,000 so the 20,000 right it's going to bring us uh, up I don't know what you can see it's going to bring us up round about there ish so let's uh, let's see where we get to and there we go um, even on that low range uh, you guys might be able to see it but that is showing me 1,000 1,000 1, So there you go, so there's a bit of discrepancy, but then again it's mechanical, so there's bound to be, um, uh, there's bound to be, uh, there must be uh, a percentage, a plus or minus on these, no idea what it is. So, what we'll do now, we'll put it on the slowest speed and see where that gets us. Okay, we're back again. Okay, I've changed the gear in now, and it should be uh, about 160 rpm okay so we're now on the lowest range okay so 160 and uh, on the lowest range it should be sort of around here ish so let's see what we get shall we and we're actually getting 100 and we're getting 145 so there you go so there's quite a discrepancy isn't it there between what it's what they say it's going to do and what it's actually doing uh, maybe it's Chinese RPM, I don't know. Maybe Chinese RPM um, is uh, somewhat different to ours. So, so there you go. So, so if you want a, a mechanical taco, um, £12.50, okay, I could have bought... Uh, a brand new digital one for that price um, but uh, I like working with old stuff I'm an old bloke and, um, and to be quite honest I find uh, digital is alright but um, I prefer, find a, prefer a nice analogue readout um, because then it's not jumping all over the place and you've got a good uh, you've got a good idea what's going on um, so there you go eBay £12.50. Can't beat it, can you? Excellent. I'm really pleased with that. Must be one of the best purchases I've made in a long time. So, from from me in the workshop, I'll say uh, goodbye for now, and thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.